Hello and Namaste. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to talk about the minimum English language test score requirements to apply for a study visa in Australia. Before we move forward, please note that your scorecard is valid for two years only. It means that if you took an English language test before two years, you will have to reappear in the test and achieve the required score again. In case you are not able to achieve the minimum score requirements, you may still be eligible to apply for ELICOS in Australia. This is an English language course designed for international students who fail to meet the minimum score requirements. Once you complete ELI course in Australia, you become eligible to begin your university course. Your education consultant or agent may be able to help further in this regard. Just consult an education consultant for more guidance. If you are going to apply for a diploma or an undergraduate course, you must achieve an overall score of 5.5 in IELTS with no individual band less than 5. Similarly, if you are going to take the PTE test, then you will have to score overall 42 with no individual band less than 36. If you are able to achieve these scores, you will meet the minimum criteria set by the Australian Immigration Department to apply for a study visa in Australia. But there is no guarantee that all the universities will accept these scores. There are few universities which accept these minimum scores, but there are many universities in Australia which demand a higher overall score than 5.5. Additionally, it also depends on the course you want to enroll into. For postgraduate or master's degree course, the minimum overall score requirement is 6 with each band not less than 5.5. In PTE, you need an overall score of 50 with each band not less than 42. I am repeating the same thing again. Most of the universities require you to score higher than these minimum scores. Now let's have a look at an example. Let's say that for a master's degree course, you score 6.5 in listening, 5.5 in reading, 5.5 in writing and 6.5 in speaking. Your overall score is 6.0. In this case, you meet both the criteria for overall minimum score, which is 6, and each band score, which is 5.5. In the second example, you achieve 6.5, 5.5, 5.0, and 7.0 respectively in listening, reading, writing, and speaking sections. Despite achieving an overall score of 6.0, you failed to meet the criteria for English language because you scored 5.0 in the writing section. In this case, you are not eligible to apply for a study visa in Australia. If you want to find out more, just visit the website of the university that you are looking to enroll into and try to download a handbook or brochure for the intended course. Usually a detailed information on scores requirement is included in there. I hope that this video was helpful to you. Please do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Best of luck everyone.